So this is why it's 89 K5 Blazer. It's got a throttle body 350 and a 700 R4. Uh, starter went bad while it was sitting. So we're gonna, he's gonna replace his first GM starter. I'm sure it won't be his last. So we're gonna start out with uh, disconnecting the battery. Cause if you don't, the heavy positive cable that goes from the battery to the starter, if you touch that, the wrench that's on that nut to the frame or anything else, it'll arc and wanna weld itself together so we're gonna get underneath here and well first we'll disconnect the battery then we'll get underneath and start taking it apart so we got under here we're gonna take this starter off and we noticed that the positive cable was just a little bit loose so we're gonna hook the battery back up tighten this cable and see what happens maybe we don't have a bad starter maybe we just have a bad connection all right we tighten the connection charge the battery for a little bit Go ahead and try it, Wyatt. There we go. Bingo. So we're underneath Wyatt's 89 Blazer now. We're going to change the TV cable on the transmission, which is TV is for throttle valve. We're going to control uh, shift pressures and shift points based on the position of the throttle and the throttle body up on top. So this is the transmission end. We're going to take that 10 millimeter bolt out, pull the cable up, disconnect it from a rod inside the transmission and connect the new one. And we'll pick up on the top once that's done. So we got the bottom end hooked up. We're back up on the top. I pulled the air cleaner off so we could see better. He's pulling the TV cable through that bracket with the square hole in it. And it only goes one way. There's little latches that catch top and bottom. And I'll show you the end of the cable here in a minute. You'll see it as it he pulls it through there. And there's a ridge on one side of the cable that goes towards the center of the engine because that's where it matches the hole in the bracket best. There's a hole in the bracket. You can see it better. I'm going to pull it through there and then we'll get it latched and I'll show you again. So we got Wyatt's cable all hooked up on the top here. It's that black plastic cable uh, that comes through the bottom of the bracket. You can see the square plug and the square hole. Cable comes up and hooks onto the very bottom of the throttle body bracket. There's a bulk adjustment there and then they say you can just put the gas pedal all the way to the floor and it'll adjust it. They got us close enough to drive it but the shift points were still soft uh, and way too early. So we had to go back through and adjust this cable tighter until we got it to between 17 and 20 miles an hour for that first shift. What you're looking at there is it was tightened down enough where it actually is shifting right at 19 and 20 every time. So it appears like it's working the way it should for now.